What's up, guys? Um, I want to talk to you guys about holidays. Uh, one being Christmas and how it doesn't make any sense to me. I, uh, I was looking around the house today and I found basically every present I had gotten, my family went unused. And this is one of the holidays that I want to just start doing away with. Because it's just a waste of money when you really come down to think about it. I bought, uh, like my dad, like this mount to mount a TV up on the wall. It, dude, we've had that like just sitting on the shelf for like five years. He never used it. I got, uh, my sister, I got her raw cacao powder and that pretty much just sat. Um, I got my mom, uh, like wheatgrass and she never used that. Um, it just kind of seems pointless to me to spend money on things that nobody's using. And the other thing is gift cards. Like, the problem with gift cards is you get like $7.28 left on a gift card, right? And then it's like, how do I use this? <laughs> you might be at like a restaurant or something. It's like, uh, it comes to the point where you just like toss it because it just, you can't. Or you have to make a return and then they can't put the money back on the gift card and it's just, it's all messy. It's, and then you have like 20 different gift cards with like, you know, $5 on all of them and it's like so, oh, just a disaster. I did actually uh, go to GameStop today and um, drop off my Xbox 360. Um, times are a changing. They uh, they gave me a gas card. I was like, whoa, that's cool. Big uh, love to GameStop for giving me the uh, gas card. Appreciate that. So you guys probably uh, want to see what my apartment looks like. Uh, right now we are in, we're like on the edge of uh, Durham County. And this is Morrisville. Uh, so let's go ahead and take a look what we got in store. I will take you on the grand tour. The um, Last night I, I was doing the blood moon thing, but uh, it was so overcast you couldn't even see anything that was going on, unfortunately. So it's really just turned into just cloudy nothingness. And um, after I got done doing the blood moon thing, I went uh, over to go upload the footage. And um, my, my PC didn't even recognize my iPhone. Like, I plugged it in. I plugged the USB cord in. And, uh, like, it didn't even um, see it. I, I pulled up my computer and I... I uh, I tried to, you know, pull the file off and upload it, and it's just like didn't even see it. It made the did not sound, but it didn't see it. I'm, I'm so I'm honestly like ready to be done with this iPhone. My contract's up in like July, and uh, it just they just limit they limit their users too much. Like you can't ever um, customize it with the uh, wallpaper, the ringtones, um, text tones. Um, basically everything. I mean, they just lock their users down too much. They got to give you more freedom. I want to be able to, like, update my cards, update my memory cards, and uh, just customize everything, and I can't. So, so I'm done with iPhone. After this is up, I, I just, no. The wallpapers, it's too much of a hassle to, to really... They make it so hard. Um, so yeah. We are um, we are located 
right next to uh, quintiles. I can actually see quintiles from my, uh, right from my apartment. It's right across the street. Nice uh, big building. A buddy of mine, uh, the database administrator for them. So, all right, I'll give you guys a view. It's pretty nice. Been in here since about uh, middle of March, so it's been uh, coming up on a month. Pollen's getting crazy. All right, I'll give you the grand tour. This is my living room. Um, we've got a bookshelf here. A nice little like spinning love couch thing. Uh, love seat here, love sack here. Uh, put on some lights. Kitchen table. This is the kitchen. Um, this is where all the magic happens, where I make my eggs and sausage, all that good stuff. And this is the front door, this way to laundry. Um, come back here and here's my master bedroom. This is all like Cali stuff. Uh, my roommate's from California and um, she wants to move back out there after her mom's moving out there this summer. She plans to follow suit. I'm actually going to go visit. I've never been out there. So yeah, that's the Golden Gate Bridge. I hear it's life altering. Um, they actually have pay phones for like suicide hotlines built in now from what I hear from so many suicides. And my room. It's kind of a mess, actually. Uh, who cares? I'll let you see it. Um, this, I have all these drills out because I'm trying to hang, uh, I just got some blackout curtains. Um, these are going to be, you know, like to reduce all the light, the parking, the parking lights are really bright at night. And then, um, uh, I just like having it black so that I can sleep in during the day. So I work at night. Uh, and I've got a nice luxurious bathroom in here. I will quickly show you. Uh, here's my bathroom. Bamboo, shower curtain, all that goodness. Okay. So, yeah. One thing I don't get is, um, like I, uh, I talked to the Cary police, and they said they use uh, SIG, a SIG 45. And I talked to the Durham police, and they said they use a M&P 45. Why are you guys using it? Why are you guys using 45 cal? It's all about shot placement. You guys should be using Glock 19s. Um, in a high stress situation. You want to be able to shoot something easy to shoot, easy to hit on target, not a lot of recoil. Doesn't get easier than a Glock 19, bar none. Just throwing that out there. I don't, I just don't get it. 45 cal is just why. It's, it's not about the caliber. It's about how well you shoot it. And I think they should be using nine millimeter bullets. Uh, so... So yeah, um, along with the uh, Astro Mix Amp dying, I just had my Razer Death Adder mouse die. It's like a gaming, something's going on, like I'm not supposed to be gaming right now or something. I The Razer Death Adder started double clicking on me where I'd be clicking, I was going through like someone's pictures online. And all of a sudden, it would just jump two pictures ahead, jump 
two pictures back and I'm like, what the hell is this? So I took it apart and it had like this ribbon cable that was soldered on. When I took it apart, it just came right out of the motherboard. And it's pretty much toast. I talked to Razor and they're like, you're out of warranty. So screw you. <laughs> yeah. Anyways. So <clears throat> uh, recently there's been rumor of Halo 2 anniversary that's supposed to come out. Honestly, I just hope they don't screw this up. I mean, they've screwed everything up within all of the past Halo games. They've been mimicking Call of Duty and Battlefield, and it's, it's just gotten to the point where it's not worth playing anymore. MLG doesn't support any of their titles. They're not in the pro circuit. They haven't been. And I'm just ready for them to do something right. 